in Amsterdam was really wonderful for us. Of course, we had bicycles, we could go everywhere, there were no signs, uh, uh, Jews uh, not permitted, uh, Jews not wanted. I mean, it was, we were just part of society, and our big uh, aim was to pick up Dutch, Dutch history, Dutch geography, and just blend in, which we succeeded in pretty well as young children. Particularly my younger sister, who only started school in September of 1936, so she had all her schooling in Dutch, and I learned it also very fast. One of the things that I always like to tell when I talk to younger people is that our family was very quickly democratized because we knew how to say things in Dutch. Our parents didn't know, so we told our parents, uh-uh, you can't say that. My mother picked up Dutch from the cleaning woman, which was not the Dutch that we learned at school. So we taught her what she can say and what she cannot say, which was very amusing and very empowering, and I, I really liked that very much. Every Wednesday afternoon in the Netherlands, uh, there was no public school Wednesday afternoons. That was when we had our Sunday school, but it wasn't on Sunday. So we went to the uh, liberal Jewish uh, religious education on bicycle, and Margot Frank, Anne's older sister, came along. And we often uh, bicycled the three of us, Margot, who was one grade ahead of me, hence in the same grade as my older sister. So my older sister Susie, Margot, and I would bicycle together to religious education.